Friends cast member and Broadway star Paxton Whitehead has died, his son Charles Whitehead has confirmed. The English actor died at the age of 85 at a hospital in Arlington, Virginia, with his son sharing the sad news with The Hollywood Reporter. Friends fans will know Paxton for portraying Mr. Waltham, Jennifer Aniston's character Rachel Green's boss at Bloomingdale's, during season 4 of the hit sitcom. Mr. Waltham was also the uncle of Emily Waltham, Helen Baxendale, who went on to marry Ross Geller, David Schwimmer, in an ill-fated London wedding in the show. He also appeared in several other popular shows, including Frasier, Caroline in the City, Ellen, Third Rock from the Sun, The Drew Carey Show, and Mad About You. Amanda Holden admits needing to cover up racy look for daughter's school event Paxton, who grew up in Kent, went on to rise to fame in the US after starring in a series of Broadway shows. His performance as Pelinor in a 1980 revival of Lerner and Low Use Camelot turned the actor a Tony nomination. After acting opposite Richard Burton in Camelot, the star went on to appear 16 more times on Broadway, from 1962 to 2018. Some of the productions he appeared in included My Fair Lady with Richard Chamberlain, Lettuce, and Lovage, Noises Off and The Importance of Being Earnest. Don't miss! GB News Michelle Dubarry defends mocking of child that identifies as cat, latest, Adele battling fungal skin infection after sitting in sweat, health update, Kevin Clifton shares life lessons from being divorced three times before age 35, comment, Paxton also starred as Sherlock Holmes in The Crucifer of Blood in 1978 and 1979. The production ran for 236 performances at the Helen Hayes Theatre. He acted opposite Glenn Close in the stage show, which was nominated for four Tony Awards. Paxton ventured onto the big screen for the first time in 1986, when he appeared in Back to School as Dr. Philip Barbie. The actor previously shared in an interview in 2017 that he preferred working on his more farcical roles on both stage and screen. Paxton said, Everybody says, they, are difficult to do, but it depends. You either have a knack for it or you don't. I think it is hard for some people. I found it not so difficult. I don't know. I just seem to respond to it. When I was younger, I would try very hard to get the vocal point right. If I felt the rhythm and sound of the character, if I got that right, and usually the difference is very subtle, then I think everything else seemed to follow, the movement and so on.